Bitcoin has perfectly broken out here and has hit already our target that we have predicted exactly yesterday to the dollar. So, but now the question is, which will be the next um, uh, significant move here for the Bitcoin price? And that is something that we have to talk about today. And if you think that's interesting, then smash up the like button, hit the subscribe button, and don't forget to activate also the bell so that you will always be notified when I put out one of these really, really important videos. So now let's get here straight into today's content. We had here this symmetrical triangle where the Bitcoin price saw a fake out to the downside, but then reversed back up and was putting in a smaller one. So you could say that here was another one. And from there, we broke out to the upside. So, but maybe we can also adjust this here to, uh, a little bit. No, we cannot adjust this. Like this okay yeah so from there we broke them to the uh, to the upside and have actually hit the original target here the bullish target of twenty thousand and sixty dollars so congratulations guys to each and everyone that was able to take the trade unfortunately i was sleeping when it was happening and i was not able to catch it so um but doesn't matter there's always a next trade so and since then uh, bitcoin um, is running now in here this next resistance area that I was also talking for quite a while already about the 20,300 to 20,450 dollar uh, level uh, more or less so and here is now something really really interesting and that is that Bitcoin has created here uh, this um, this rising channel and right now it looks like that we are about to break down out of this channel so but something else that i want to point out here on the one hourly chart we have also put in another higher high which is obviously also bullish for the immediate short term for bitcoin so but where will bitcoin go next so for this i want to take the fibonacci extensions so i believe bitcoin could come back to 19,300 19,250 uh, in the immediate short term so and basically putting here a BART pattern in, um, but only if we are not breaking above $20,400 and closing there for hourly and daily candle above that level. So if we are, uh, if Bitcoin cannot manage to break $20,400 and stay uh, above that level and find support here, so then we most likely go back all the way down to $19,300. Um, yeah, $19, Dollars. So where would I start putting in a, a short position for that? So for this, we look where we had the former resistance, a key resistance area. So and that was more or less here at $19,860. So once we are breaking that level, I would short this down to $19,300. So if we are breaking to the upside, uh, the $20,400, level so then then we can trade this at least to twenty one thousand two hundred dollars approximately in my opinion so there you have it guys you have a bullish and a bearish target so and let me just change the color so that you can see it better bullish here the bearish one so but in any case we can uh, profit from uh, Bitcoin's move here in the immediate short term, doesn't matter if we go up or down. So, and if you wanna take advantage of that, guys, don't forget on Bybit, you still get $4,550 absolutely for free if you use this specific link and a $1,000 Ethereum trade on top of that. So here, there is still 21% left of the uh, supply for this trade so definitely take advantage of that the link is in the pin comment below and in the description of the video so if you want some free money just sign up there deposit a little bit of money start trading boom there you go so let's go to the daily chart so here we saw we see now is in significant bounce here from this support line that i was talking yesterday about but we are also running into resistance on the daily chart in this downward sloping uh, resistance line and the horizontal uh, resistance level at twenty thousand six hundred dollars so and that's why we saw here a premature uh, rejection already uh, but actually let me adjust this a little bit yeah it, you, you you can uh, you can put it either like like this or where I had it it doesn't really change a lot so we, we were running here already into resistance and that's why we saw 
uh, here a small rejection from the twenty thousand four hundred dollar level. So and um, yeah, here in the in the next week we will actually know where Bitcoin might be heading either lower or higher um, because we are running here into this apex of the support level and the downward sloping resistance line. So that will be quite interesting to watch. Um, yeah, exactly uh, tomorrow in one week what's going to happen here. But right now on the daily chart, uh, the stochastic RSI is pointing to the upside. So we could see actually a break of the downward sloping resistance line. The question is how long can we uh, stay above that level before we potentially see another pullback below it. So um, that is, I think, what most people um, are looking out for because in, in the in the past when we came now above this downward sloping resistance line, we could not manage to stay there for a long time above it and got slammed down from um, other resistance levels under this resistance line once again. So here also in the weekly chart, things starting to look a little bit more bullish because of this bullish divergence, it looks like that we are starting to see um, the initial move of this uh, bullish, uh, bullish weekly divergence here. So, and don't forget guys, if we close this weekly candle outside, for example, at the same price where we are, uh, where we are right now, um, then we will most likely pump all the way up to $23,600 to retest the 200 weekly EMA. So, and that will be a massive, massive trade opportunity that I will personally take with um, a lot of my uh, available trading capital. Um, because if we manage to break then above $23,600, then the next stop would be almost $30,000 for Bitcoin. So that would be a really, really, really nice trading opportunity for us. Guys, that's it already for today's uh, video. Again, I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget, smash up the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you again tomorrow.